Welcome back to another episode of Watch and Shoes. The watch is the Invicta Hybrid. Been rocking that this whole weekend. So you've been seeing a lot of that if you've been watching these videos this weekend. Um, the shoe is not an animal skin. It's a Puma. Very well made, well stitched Puma. With big fat black laces. And some form of either lizard or gator or just exotic leather looking shoe. This is a stamped leather, so it's not actually a real uh, animal. It is real leather, I believe, but it's not um, a, an animal. It's definitely stamped. A very good job on it, stamping. That's why I went, went ahead and bought it. Also, a very good job of making this appear to be a well-built shoe. As you can see, all the way to the nose, you have what appears to be leather. So, whether it's genuine animal, exotic animal or not, it's a well-made shoe and it's intended for you to appreciate the uh, extreme amounts of leather, even the leather foot ins insole, uh, leather tongue. I mean, they really went hard in trying to give you a real quality shoe. Fit and finish here, they did not have fabric poking out like so many other um, brands do when they don't care to complete the, the shoe. So that was pretty impressive to me. Uh, you got the Puma logo on the tongue, very big Puma logo. If I'm not mistaken, this tongue goes all the way up, and this is part of the tongue. It goes all the way up to the top, no interruptions. So that's also something you do when you want to make a comfortable shoe for the buyer. And that's what they did with this shoe, and it's very much appreciated and caused me to be a buyer. Um, it's a completed shoe. Uh, I'm a huge fan of the white bottom shoe and the black upper or brown upper talked about that in a previous video but uh yeah puma did a great job of, to my understanding this is not a collaboration this shoe is called states so puma states that may be the collaboration but i see no uh no attempt to let you know that there's collaboration with anybody this is just an extremely well-made puma and when i see these especially on sale and typically if i own it it was on sale um, it's going to be a buy every time. It's just a very well-made shoe. You can see the double stitching going on here. Why? Just to make a quality shoe. It's definitely not needed. You've got double stitching here. Obviously not playing basketball in these shoes or any other kind of activity. So going the extra mile when it's not needed, that's a great way to uh, grab my attention and create a sale. So that's my uh, black Puma and for people who are so interested to know what the leather is made out of, uh, if they ask me I'll tell them leather, <laughs> but if, uh, if they don't they'll leave thinking I have a, a animal skin Puma which is pretty exotic. So thank you Puma for that look alike, did a great job with it. Thanks for watching another episode of Watch and Shoes. Watch and Shoes. Hope you enjoyed. See you on the next video.